here's what's happening at Utopia Farms today. So that will stay up now for the whole summer. But today we're fixing the corn planter. Good wide rumps on them. Good wide loins. If you are going to have an emergency, uh, there's no escape route there. All have good length on them. See the good length on these sheep? Let's get started. Hi, hot lips. Are you wanting to go out again today? Hey, what are you looking at? What are you looking at? While the weather is nice, we're gonna let these sheep out again. I forgot we had them mixed up. They use in the yearlings. So I thought, why is she in here? We had one that hurt her foot. Doing God knows what. But she's limping a bit. But she looks alright. It's not scald or anything. Probably running in the fields tripped on something or on the stampede like we have here. It's very easy for someone to get hurt in this number of sheep. Uh, why don't I get in the feeder? Hey, I'm going to get in the feeder. So, yeah, someone can really get hurt here in this crush to go out. Maybe you should climb over first. You don't want to fall down in a stampede. Oh, sweetheart, you can try. Poor girl. That's them. All that, and they'll only stay out half an hour. But it'll be a really fun half an hour. But I imagine that's what happened to her um, in the push to go out like that. She probably got pushed against the gate and stubbed her foot on the gate because there's nothing else she could have really gotten hurt on. But it is supposed to be a rainy day today, so may as well let them out now while it's still nice. So we got a bit of sunshine right now. It's going to rain again today, but we got warm temperatures now. So what we're going to do today is get start getting these curtains rolled up and by rolled up it means that they get rolled from the bottom and they get locked into the top underneath the eaves up here and they stay locked up. We And when they're locked up you can't move them up and down but in the summer you don't really need to move them up and down. Um, it's basically at that point like being outdoors except with a roof but 
we have to roll them up first like this and close the barn down so that all the water gets out of the curtain. So we're gonna roll up one side of the barn, let the sun dry it off, and then roll it under the eaves and this barn will be locked and loaded, ready for summer. No more up and downs. So we're just rolling up uh, one of the curtains today. So I, I rolled it, I, I pulled it to the top to let it dry out because it rained so hard here the last couple of days. You can see the water right there. And now we're going to roll it up. So I'm just going to grab this. Sorry about that. Just had to roll that up, uh, run the drill and uh, run the core of this drill. And so you can see it, it went right to the very top and it's tucked right underneath that soffit, you can call it, and it'll stay dry. And that curtain will last a lot longer staying dry than it will be laying in the water all year round. So that will stay up now for the whole summer. And there's Lynn right over there checking up on me. And we're doing the natural thing. I don't know if you can see it, but the sheep are out there stampeding for some reason. So they got this, they got this beautiful lush grass right now. grass is extremely rich. This beautiful grass with my beautiful wife. Oh, don't, don't those Danny lions set her off? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we the others. Hey, huh? There's a 
new cable. And that, and that cable will go on to the marker on the right hand side. So now I'm just going to shove that, this device, right back down in that hole. And it should work. So, got it fixed there. See how, uh, see how this works. You're falling asleep. You're extremely calm and relaxed. In a few minutes, you're gonna pass out. Just doing night chores. Genovas and we don't test their sheep we're just looking for the ones that grow and are vigorous so you can see these lambs here have no trouble eating you like to see that you want to see them eating. If they're eating, they're putting the muscling on. So I'm just doing night chores. I'm a little behind tonight, so I'm trying to get caught up. But yeah, these... Uh, we're looking for vigorous sheep, eh? There's actually a few of them in here waiting to get in the trough. So... I'm just cleaning up, cleaning up right now. And they're looking good. Oh, you're looking pretty good, buddy. Good little spread on front feet there. Hey, bud. Now, it's not about you. So they're all doing real well. Nice bunch of lambs right there. Good, good wide rumps on them. Good wide loins. So we're just gonna go over here and see how the king of the the king the king of the sheep are doing. I always find the Sussex are the top of the food chain. So let's see how they're doing for one second here. I should have put that trough a little farther apart, maybe. If you are going to have an emergency, uh, there's no escape route there. That could be an uh, entrapment. But they're all eating real well. Oh, that's quite a roll of sheep. Nice bunch of lambs. All have good length on them. See the good length on these sheep? We actually choose rams that are long. We don't like to choose any rams that are a little bit uh, short in the on the, on the on the body. But yeah, they're. Uh, I probably should have put those troughs a little farther apart. That's a little tight. Can 
good meaty rumps on them? So, pretty happy, they're doing well. So, we're gonna move on to the next barn. Come on, don't be looking at the dog. Let's move on. And they have enough hay for tonight, so I'm gonna feed them in the morning. And they're getting a little bit dampy with the rain. We've had so much rain today, so. They may be getting some uh, more straw in here tomorrow. And I put too much treat feed out so I can't close the lid. So any raccoon that's around tonight is going to have a field day. Just like going to the Pizza Hut. Anyways. That's all I can do here. I just got a feed the other barn yet? Oh, it's been raining all day. Water puddles all over the road. Yeah. Kind of push you in a tight spot for putting crops in. Because it's going to be, uh, it's going to get extremely busy here shortly. Let's put the lights on here. So I'm going to feed these guys for one second and uh, hang on there and I'll tell you what's happening. So I just fed, just fed all the lambs and on the right hand side they're all females. Oh actually that's not true. There's a bunch of big males in here yet. we got to take them out but they're mostly all females on the right hand side. And this is I'm going to kick this hay in a little bit for them. And these sheep here, we're going to choose some of them. We're going to go to the market here. So I'm just going to level this hay for tonight. And uh, they should have enough hay for tonight. And we'll give them a brand new bale in the morning. So that's what we're doing now. Come on, get out of here. Nobody wants you here. So I'm just going to finish this up. I'm late tonight. You can see how dark it is outside. And I've got to get out of here and get going.